Hello everyone, hope you are doing good. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to use arguably one of the best CRM softwares for marketers, as I will be showing you how to use Spotler CRM. Spotler CRM prides itself on being an easy to use beginner friendly CRM which is perfect for small businesses or medium sized businesses and it is also very affordable. For instance, if I were to go on their pricing page, by the way, you can get started for completely free as they offer a 14 day free trial period. And if you like their platform and the features that they offer, you can go on their paid plan which starts off at $21 per month and it goes up to $64 per month on their enterprise plan. By scrolling down, you'll be able to see the different features that you'll get with each price mark. So you can see right here on the free trial, you'll be able to add 100 company records and you'll get access to unlimited contacts. And you can also see that you'll only get 100 MB storage. But if you were to go onto their paid plan, you'll get one gig storage. And you'll also get access to their sales CRM on the free plan. And you can scroll down and you can see the different features. If you are interested to see all the features before signing up, which I do recommend that you check out, I think that you should tap on pricing at the top right here. Then you could scroll down and read each feature. And if it is a case that you are able to use the free trial and get the access to the platform or the features that you need for your business, you can do that. Once you are signed up, you will be redirected to this dashboard. And as I said, Spotler CRM prides itself on being simple and easy to understand. So you can see that their dashboard isn't fancy. It is just straight to the point. And if you want to add your contacts, which more than likely will be the first thing that you want to do on your CRM, you can go over to the left hand menu option, tap on contacts. Once you have tapped on contacts, you will be redirected to this page. Once on this page to add contacts, you can go over to the top right hand corner, tap right where you see add. After you have tapped on add, from here, you can enter the contact name. So you can first search for an account. Then from there, you'll be able to tap on add new contact and you can fill in their information. Once you have filled in their information, you can tap on save in the top right hand corner to save the contact information. Also, by going over to the left hand menu option, if I were to tap on accounts, which is the second option at the top right there, from here, you can start adding individuals. So you could tap on add. And from there, you can start adding various accounts as you can see right here. And to create your first tax, and to create your first task on Spotler CRM, all you will need to do is tap on tasks from the left option. Then you can get an example of how your task will look. For example, if I were to select this task right here, you can see how the layout looks right here. So if this is something that you like, as I said again, remember with Spotlaw, they pride themselves on being simple and to the point. To create your first task, all you'll need to do is tap on tasks. Once you're on the task dashboard, you'll tap on add in the top right hand corner. Then from there, you'll be able to add your account name and you'll be able to fill in the information for your task. You'll be able to choose the priority as you can see right there. And you can also set the task status. After you're finished, you can tap on save in the top right hand corner. And by the way, they also have a calendar which you would expect from any CRM. So you can see right here, this is the calendar at the moment. And you'll be able to view your tasks, different tasks on the calendar right here. And later on in the tutorial, I'll be showing you how to integrate other calendars or other apps on Spotter CRM. But if you would like to view all your reports, you can tap on reports from left hand menu option. And you can view your reports right here. You can also add listings. You can add forecasts by tapping on forecast right there. 
And by the way, to see all your sales activities, you could tap on sales activities right here. And by the way, if you would also like to add opportunities, you can do that by tapping on opportunities from the left hand menu option right below sales. Then you could tap on add and from there you'll be able to add different opportunities. And you can also see that you get access to create quotations using Spotler CRM. Now, when it comes on to marketing, they do have some good features. For example, if I were to tap on campaigns from the left hand menu option, then tap on add in the top right hand corner, I will be redirected to this page. And from here, I can type in the campaign name, just say test for example sake. Once you have typed in your campaign name, you will tap on save. Then from here, you can scroll down and you can see the different templates that they provide. So once you have found a template that you like, let's say for example this template, you can simply tap on it. Once you have tapped on it, you will be redirected to this page. From here, you'll now be able to edit your template. So you can see the basic layout right here. Anything that you would like to add, you can do that by simply tapping on bill. Then you can drag and drop any item that you want. You can also change the style by tapping on global style and scrolling down, you can change the background color, the font color, and so on. If you would like to send a test email, you could tap on test and preview. Then from there, you can enter the email address that you'd like to send it to, and you could tap on send test email. And that's how you'll be able to send a test email. And that's basically it when it comes on to Spotler CRM. And now to integrate different apps on this platform, you will need to tap on settings in the top right hand corner, right beside your profile pic. After you have tapped on settings, you can tap on integrations right here. Once you have tapped on integrations, you can see the different apps or platforms that you'll be able to integrate. So you can see right there, you could tap on Zapier for instance. Once you have tapped on Zapier, you'll see integrate your CRM to over 1000 other cloud apps. And you can see the other apps that you can add using Zap. All you'll need to do is tap on use this Zap to integrate it. And that's it. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe. And thank you again for watching. And if there is anything that I left out that you would like to learn more about Spotler CRM, please let me know in the comment section.